10. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Engine start and liftoff. The SS Kulpnachavla takes flight, sights set on the International Space Station. Pitch and roll program are in. Engines are steady and nominal, 100%. Altitude, 20,000 feet. One minute into the flight, everything looking good on Antares. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Ignition, lift off. We're pitching down range. Stage one propulsion is nominal. T plus 40 seconds, Falcon 9 successfully lifting off from launch pad 39A at the Kennedy Space Center in Florida. Uh, we're taking that Starlink orbit to its first, Starlink satellites to its first targeted orbit and eventually a circular orbit. We actually just throttled down for maximum dynamic pressure, or max Q, on those nine Merlin engines. We'll expect to hear that call out here shortly. Vehicle supersonic. Terminal guidance. Stage one, landing leg deploy. Looks like right in the center. That marks 61 successful recoveries. Third time for this booster. shot from our drone on her way to space lunar landing tech on board payloads inside you can see at the top right of your screen there new shepherds gaining speed that be3 engine is really doing its work what a clean burn first milestone here is max q There we go. All right, come on, New Shepard, let's go. Wow. Look at that stability. 
so stable. Touch. Oh my God. Down. New Shepherd. It's Here incredible. we go. I, I love watching. All right, oh, and touch is. down of the capsule. Oh. All right. She made it back. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And lift off. Kate Rubin, Sergey Rishikov, and Sergey Kuzverchkov now on their way to the International Space Station. The latest in a chain that spans almost 20 years of continuous human presence in space. 10 seconds. The parameters of the rocket are nominal. Twenty seconds. The thrusters of the first and second stage are operating nominally. Hearing first good reports of a good first stage performance. Everything looking nominal. So he's currently delivering 930,000 pounds of thrust from its four boosters and single engine of that first stage. It measures 68 feet in length and 24 feet in diameter and burns liquid fuel for the first two minutes and six seconds of flight. 50 seconds. The pressure in the chambers is nominal. Everything is good on board. We feel well. Good reports from the crew as well. Everything looking good with today's flight. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Ignition and lift off. Falcon 9 has successfully lifted off from Pad 39A at Kennedy Space Center, carrying our Starlink payload to its targeted drop-off orbit. Uh, moments ago, we've begun to throttle down our engines on the first stage in preparation for Max Q. Uh, Max Q is where the vehicle will experience the vehicle highest amount Starlink. of aerodynamic pressure. There's a few of our drone ship. And right down the middle, Falcon 9 has landed. Uh, this particular booster has landed for the sixth time. This marks our 62nd successful recovery of a Falcon 9 first stage. And the 32nd time we've landed on this particular drone ship, uh, of course, I still love you. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Zero. Mission. And we have lift off. plus 40 seconds into liftoff. Falcon 9 has successfully lifted off from Pad 40 at Cape Canaveral Air Force Station, carrying our Starlink payload out into space. Now, we just throttled down the engines in preparation for MAX-Q, which stands for Maximum Aerodynamic Pressure. This is the largest structural load that the vehicle will see throughout ascent. Should be coming up on MAX-Q in a few seconds here. Stage one landing burn. There's confirmation, stage one landing burn. You can kind of see 
that burn kind of shaking the camera there. Stage one landing leg deploy. Speaker. Stage one landing. Oh, and we had a little bit of a rough camera view there, but the Falcon has landed on our drone ship for its third landing on Just Read the Instructions. This marks our 63rd successful recovery of a Falcon first stage and the 11th for Just Read the Instructions. And Battery discharge nominal. And there goes Electron for our 15th launch from Rocket Lab Launch Complex 1 in New Zealand. We're T plus 50 seconds and Electron is approaching max Q or maximum aerodynamic pressure. The moment during its ascent when the forces Everyone. against the vehicle are at their strongest. Clear at maximum dynamic pressure. Drive round two. Enter drive round three. 